What's up everybody, it's Joel here and in this video we are going to learn how to set up a Node.js server in Heroku. So, let's jump right in. First of all, we are going to need a Heroku account. So, create one or log in. After that, we are going to create a new app on the dashboard and I will give a name to the server. It's going to be my tutorial app socket. And I will create the app. Now I will configure the deployment method to use GitHub. To do this, I'm going to log in my GitHub and use this repo. This is an official repo from Heroku that has a Node.js server example. I will create a fork of this repo. So I'm going to have a copy of this repo inside my account. After creating the fork, I'm going to configure the deployment method on Heroku. So I'm going to select GitHub and connect to GitHub. I will give Heroku my GitHub credentials and now I can search for the repo that I just forked and connect it to it. Now, I'm going to enable automatic deploys from the main branch and on manual deploy I will force deploy just for us to see the website. Now we can see the real-time logs from the server. It is installing dependencies, building and build succeeded. So we can open the app. If we reload, we're going to see the app that we just created. Now let's test if the auto deployment is working. Let's clone the repo that we just forked. I'm going to use git clone with my HTTPS link and I'm going to jump to the folder and now I'll open Atom to edit the server. I'm going to change something on the main screen of the app. And now I will add this change to my commit and commit with the name of my first commit and then push the changes. After that, if we go to activity, we can see that there is a build running and actually it already succeeded. So if we reload the app, we're going to see the change that we just made. We have another deployment working. That's it for today's video. Here you can click and watch some new videos and if I helped you, make sure to like and subscribe. See you soon.